Hello, welcome to another Tips and Tricks Tuesday. I hope that you are enjoying your summer. It's beautiful weather out here in California. And today we are going to talk about a feature that's been in the product for a long time, but I find that people don't really use it. It's called Object Snap Tracking. It is so, so powerful. Just as an example here, I have this box in the middle of the screen, right? If I asked you to draw a circle right in the center of that box, how would you find the center? I mean, would you draw a line from one corner to the other and then grab the midpoint to get the center? I'm going to show you how with object snap tracking, you don't have to draw any construction lines. Let me show you how easy it is. So first off, let's go in the circle command. And you'll see that I have my object tracking on, object snap tracking. So you want to make sure that's on, right? And I'm going to move my cursor up to the midpoint of that of that side of the box. I'm not picking anything. I'm just moving up there and it'll automatically it'll grab the midpoint and give me this nice object tracking line. If I move my cursor away, you'll see there's a little plus sign. Okay, that's that, I'm halfway there. Let's go over to the other side and grab the midpoint of that side and you'll see sure enough now how easy is that? It's easy for me to find the midpoint and draw my circle. Love that. Don't you love that? Let's let's just take a look at that one more time because I want to make sure you get the, get this completely. I'm going to go to the circle command. Once again, I'm going to grab the midpoint over here. Right, and then as I move my cursor over here, I grab the midpoint over here. Now, what if you goof? What if you didn't want that point? Oh, you, that was the wrong object snap. No problem. Move your cursor back over. Once again, I'm not picking anything. I'm just moving my cursor over the area, and you'll see once I moved my cursor back over the same area, it it scrubbed it out. It erased it like it didn't count. Pick it once. There it is. Pick it again. It goes away. Makes sense. All right, but I do want to grab that side. So once again, how easy is that? Super simple. Okay. No construction lines. So let me give you another example of how you can use object snap tracking. I need to insert a bolt, and I want to insert that bolt. I need it to match up with this top view over here, right? So let's go in the insert command. I spelled it out, taking too much time, right? <laughs> Hit OK. As I move my cursor up here, I need to line it up right up here with this top view. I'll move my cursor up there and just pull it straight down into place. And I know that that absolutely lines up. One more time, just because it's fun. Come up here, grab the center of that top view, and pull it right on down. Easy, easy, easy. Doesn't get any easier than that. So I want you to remember object snap tracking when you're drawing. Think about how you can use it to be more efficient. I think you're going to find it very, very powerful, and it's going to help you get your job done just a little bit faster so you can truly enjoy the summer, right? So thanks for joining me again, and I'll see you or talk to you next Tuesday.